have you here is that you will share in our DC values. We are proud of the 700,000 people who call Washington home, and we want you to get to know local Washington, D.C. as well, where we celebrate diversity and inclusivity, the best of all American values. We are a global city, we are a welcoming city, and we are a city that loves visitors from around the world. While you are here, you will enjoy the hospitality of our hotels and restaurants and and you will meet Washingtonians who share in all these values. So, This month we also celebrate the arts, we celebrate culture and creativity, and we hope that you will get to see our monuments and memorials. I want to make it very clear that D.C. is open and we are here to welcome you this time and every time. Welcome to Washington. Thank you so much, Mayor Bowser. We are here, 600,000 people are here. Look at them, we are so happy that your town is open for all of us. We are so pleased that all of you came out tonight and are joining us here today because we are thrilled to be having a celebration and to be supporting that all of us can come together from all over the world and celebrate in each other's different music, food. I'm sure you've also been enjoying the pavilions by day. And if you haven't, please come tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> Superb. Ladies and gentlemen, it is our honor and privilege to introduce Honorable Rick Scott. Please join us in welcoming him to the stage. What a night. It's beautiful to be here. Uh, on behalf of everybody in D.C., including the mayor, thank you for coming to Washington, D.C., our nation's capital. Uh, thank you for coming to the United States of America, those that are, have come from overseas. Uh, we welcome visitors. This, we, uh, we hope we're the best melting pot in the world. Uh, Girl Dave, Shri Shri, thank you for what you believe in. Thank you for your belief in unity. Thank you for your effort to bring people together from all over the world. Uh, thank you for what you've done for others and bring us all together. I want to... Uh, Recognize all the distinguished uh, individuals up here on the stage. I also want to really recognize the ambassador from India, who's uh, from, uh, he does an unbelievable job uh, representing uh, this the country of India, which is a great friend of the United States. Uh, I want to thank the, uh, the uh, Secretary General of the United Nations for being here and everyone else. I've had the opportunity in my lifetime to visit probably 50 countries. And what you do learn is everybody has the same goals. They want to be fully employed, they love their children, they want them to get a great education, they're this their future, and they want to live in a safe community all over the world. We all want the same things for our families. So thank you for talking about that, those types of things tonight. For the people of India, I, um, I think of India this way. You've, uh, you have wonderful people that live there, you're great friends to the United States of America to Americans. Uh, many of you have immigrated to our country, you bring culture, uh, you completely change and improve our country all the time. I've got one of my great friends from Florida here, I want to recognize Danny Guyquad, I'm not sure who Danny is, and his wonderful family. So, who, uh, I was the governor of Florida, uh, and uh, Danny was one of the best promoters of uh, both India and the state of Florida, and he's a, he's a great friend. One thing I like about India, and many places in the world, is it's a place where you, it's a land of opportunity. Where anybody, you can come from any background and have leisure, live to your dream. 
And that's where I think of the United States, that's where I think of Washington, D.C., that's where I think of my great state. I look forward to a future where all of us together get to build the futures that we each want for our families, our countries, and our world. I hope we all want the same thing, a safe world where we all have great opportunities. So thank you very much for the opportunity to be here. I hope you have a wonderful night. Now, I can't, I'll be remiss if I don't ask you all to come to the great state of Florida, for we, like uh, the mayor here, we love our visitors. Have a great night. And one thing is for sure, we also love the sunshine in Florida. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you, Senator Rick Scott. And in that same spirit of peace and celebration, we welcome folk rhythms of the Andes for vibrant and graceful folk dances from Colombia, Peru, and Bolivia.